Hey, what's up and welcome back to my channel. I found the perfect mouse and keyboard for my Mac and PC setup. So check out this video. So what did I buy? First of all, the Amex Master 3. Secondly, to compare it, the Amex Master 3S and the Amex keys for Mac. So let's unbox those first and see what's inside. I start first with the Amex Master 3. So first of all, the mouse itself with the Bluetooth receiver and some paper stuff and USB-A to USB-C charging cable. I just put back the cable and the paper stuff because I don't need it. The same with a USB receiver. And the Amex Master 3S. Looks a little bit different now, the package. You see here on the old one, the MX Logitech, Logitech on top, and the newer one has no print. I bought this in black. Actually, we have the same stuff inside, the USB-A bolt, USB receiver the cable and the paper stuff again. And lastly, the USB, not USB, the Bluetooth MX keys for Mac, for the keyboard. You see the MX again on top like the older one MX Master 3 They're packaged nicely it has a weight USB connection, on off switch. Then we have again the USB connection or USB receiver, but I will connect all of them via Bluetooth. Okay, this is the content, so here we have now the Amex 3, Amex 3S and the keys all side by side. I'm gonna put away the boxes and then let's compare and see how the mouse or the mice and the keyboard works.
let's start first with the keyboard on on switch keyboard has already power we have here a blinking flashing led to switch the computers i think now it's in uh, pairing mode so this is how to change it and the feel is quite good we have a nice stand i think i have to wait a little bit there's outside the cleaning truck Feels very good. We have here no expandable feet for a higher stand, but actually for me, it does feel very good. Okay. Let's go to the MX Master 3s. So the 3 version on my right and the 3S on my left hand. When we compare the design, it's exactly the same. I just chose the different color. The older one has the uh, light gray version for Mac. And uh, for the newer one, I chose the black version or the space gray version there are also other colors for uh yeah for the regular mice um like pale gray space gray and all this stuff but this is what you can check out on the website so ergonomic wise the mice feels quite good in the hands uh, on my right side we have the amix master 3 and on my left hand side the amix master 3s but the feel is exactly the same also all the buttons layout is the same you can hear the scroll wheel just clickable and there's a button here on top i think i have to turn it on first to say non-clickable so you can see it here again and then we have a button and then you can hear and feel the clicks yeah you saw in the background that uh, this is already in use so just let me try this out uh, we have here on the bottom side we have a button for the switch mode so we have three options the first one right now goes on my iMac let's turn on the screensaver when you click on the thumb, uh, actually everything works fine uh, when I use it. Uh, this is special for my setup. I'm using the iMac. I'm using here on, on the middle side. The, this is here the second mode. I'm using my MacBook. And on the right hand side, mode 3, I'm using my Windows computer. So this works fine. Um, it's very easy to switch, very convenient. But maybe for the next version, for the MX Master 4, maybe uh, Logitech, maybe you can put this button here on top that. Uh, we don't have to turn it around for switching uh, the computers. We have here the on-on switch, on-off switch. We have on the Amix Master 3S. 
exactly the same buttons. The difference between the two is first um, the DPI. So this one has 4000 DPI and the 3S has 8000 DPI. And the other difference is the click. So on this one, we have like the old school mechanical clicks. And the newer one has those soft clicks. It's they declared uh, as 90% less noise. Let's compare them again. old one, new one. So is it is it worth the upgrade from the 3 to the 3S? In my opinion, it feels exactly the same. The clicks, it's in your decision if you like more the noisier mouse or the, the quiet mouse, the DPI maybe not uh, so important of course it's much better on the newer one but uh, actually it's a new decision uh, which one you gonna buy thanks for watching uh, and see you in the next one this is your man can and have fun bye